Selamat pagi, my friends from Indonesia. In this video, I would like to talk about our text-to-speech software that, of course, includes several languages and our dialects from Indonesia. At our text-to-speech software, you can sign up for free. You can easily start testing out the software. Our text-to-speech software is a bridge between the technologies of Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud, and IBM. Once you are registered, you can easily search for the different languages that are available, including the ones from Indonesia. And we can start by having here and listening the previews of the Indonesian language. If there is any other dialect from the Indonesia area that you might prefer to listen, you can also skip to the segment that it's more for your interest. So here we can see the available voices that can be tested. We have the Microsoft Azure that in our recommendations and also Microsoft Azure also have announced that they will re be removing the non-neural voices since they are more robotic and the Microsoft Azure will be only keeping the neural voices since these are improved via artificial intelligence. Also, there's the Google Cloud platform and it has also some of the different voices and of course the female and male voices for Indonesia with the neural voices. So let's listen. You will be the ones who are going to judge, who say, okay, this is good, this is bad, because of course I don't know that much of Indonesian language. I have some very good friends from Indonesia. I only know the word roti, which is breath. But so please write down the comments what do you think about the voice and the accent. So let's start and listen to the female voice of Microsoft Azure. Halo, Anda dapat menggunakan salah satu suara kami untuk mensintesis teks Anda sesuai kebutuhan. Tambahkan efek suara tambahan untuk lebih menyempurnakan ucapan Anda. Dan Anda juga dapat menggunakan suara saraf untuk membuat ucapan Anda terdengar seolah-olah diucapkan oleh manusia hidup. Kami harap Anda akan menikmati layanan kami. Now let's listen a male voice. Halo, Anda dapat menggunakan salah satu suara kami untuk mensintesis teks Anda sesuai kebutuhan. Tambahkan efek suara tambahan untuk lebih menyempurnakan ucapan Anda, dan Anda juga dapat menggunakan suara saraf untuk membuat ucapan Anda terdengar seolah-olah diucapkan oleh manusia hidup. Kami harap Anda akan menikmati layanan kami. Now let's compare it with the voices of Google Cloud. Halo, Anda dapat menggunakan salah satu suara kami untuk mensintesis teks Anda sesuai kebutuhan. Tambahkan efek suara tambahan untuk lebih menyempurnakan ucapan Anda, dan Anda juga dapat menggunakan suara saraf untuk membuat ucapan Anda terdengar seolah-olah diucapkan oleh manusia hidup. Kami harap Anda akan menikmati layanan kami. Now, a male voice. Halo, Anda dapat menggunakan salah satu suara kami untuk mensintesis teks Anda sesuai kebutuhan. Tambahkan efek suara tambahan untuk lebih menyempurnakan ucapan Anda. Dan Anda juga dapat menggunakan suara saraf untuk membuat ucapan Anda terdengar seolah-olah diucapkan oleh manusia hidup. Kami harap Anda akan menikmati layanan kami. So now let's continue with the other dialects, language from Indonesia. And it was also recently added the Javanese with the Microsoft Azure voices. So let's listen to the female voice. Hello. Sampean bisa gunaake suara apa wae kanggo nyintesis teks yen perlu. Tambah efek suara tambahan kanggo nambah wicara lan uga sampean bisa gunaake suara saraf kanggo gawe suara wicara kaya sing diucapake dening manungsa urip. Muga-muga sampean bakal seneng layanan kita. Now a male voice. Halo, sampean bisa gunaake suara apa wae kanggo nyintesis teks yen perlu. Tambah efek suara tambahan kanggo nambah wicara, lan uga sampean bisa nggunakake suara saraf kanggo gawe suara wicara kaya sing diucapake dening manungsa urip. Muga-muga sampean bakal seneng layanan kita. And to keep up with the next dialect from Indonesia, we have Sundanese. Let's listen to the female voice. 
Halo, anjun tiasa nganggo salah sahiji sora kami pikun nyinsist anjun upami diperyogikun. Tambihkan sora tambahan pikun ningkatkan pidato anjun, sareng anjun ok tiasa nganggo sora sara pikun ngajankan ucapan anjun saulah-olah dicapkan ku manusia hirup. Kami ngarepkan anjun bakal resep jasa kami. Now, the male voice. Halo, anjen tiasa nganggo salah sahiji sora kami piken yen sistes anjen upami diperyogikan. Tambihkan sora tambahan piken ningkatkan pidato anjen sareng anjen ok tiasa nganggo sora sara piken ngajantenken ucapan anjen saulah-olah diucapkan ku manusia hirup. Kami ngarepkan anjen bakal resep jasa kami. And this is how it sounds. These are the dialects that are available for Indonesia. And basically, if you're aiming to use the software, it's really easy. I will do, do some tests. I will just choose the English from the USA. Here, we also have the Amazon Web Services. And mainly, the one that I mostly use is the guy's voice. So I can just write. And... We can also create folders here by creating new projects. And in this way, you can order the audios that you can be creating here. For example, we can set up all the new audios that we will create in that video folder. So this is more for organizational purposes as well. According to the different provider that you might use, there are different controls that will make vary or variance to the volume how the number should be set, the speed and the pitch. But in this case, I mostly rec recommend to use the extreme controls in order to see a real effect on the change of the voice. And also, if you want to add time in between, we have also the pauses. Once you are fine with the text that you have written, we also recommend to synthesize directly in order to have already for download the files because even if you listen, the listening of the preview will use some of the characters and in order to optimize, we recommend to previously really check your text and do the synthesization of the text so that we can have already the audio. So let's click here. And we will have here ready to listen the preview. Hello, I am Carlos. This is a text-to-speech software. And once you're fine with the audio, you can just click and download. And basically, this is a really simple software that it can be good to use for YouTube videos, for TikTok, for Instagram, for any other social media platform or, or for internal video purposes, even also for answering machines. They are also, that's another use case of the text-to-speech software. So please write on the comments if you have some questions, you have some doubts, or if you're looking some for some other alternatives, don't hesitate to ask. Go directly to the website. I leave down in the description the link. Register for free. Thanks for watching.